Well, ever since Hurricane Ian, we've seen a lot of these in our waterways, abandoned boats across our area. Florida Fish and Wildlife is hoping to make it easier now for local governments to get reimbursed for being forced to remove these derelict yeah, boats. Th that would likely speed up the work. NBC2's Muhammad Abdul Kowi is live at the Old Bridge Marina in Fort Myers, speaking with people who are really hopeful about this change. Yeah, that's right, Peter and Kelly. These boats here on the Old Bridge Marina are everywhere. Everywhere you look, there's boats. Um, or over there, you can see just how much rust is collecting. Again, these boats have been here since two years ago, since Hurricane Ian. But now the state will give counties money to remove these boats and, like you just said, to hopefully speed up this process. When you cross the Edison Bridge to get to North Fort Myers, the first thing that you will see are more than a dozen boats of all shapes and sizes just sitting at the Old Bridge Marina. We can't do anything until we get those permits to remove these vessels. Savannah Skaggs worked at the Old Bridge Marina before Ian. She's anxiously waiting for these unclaimed boats to be removed. Right now we cannot clean this up as it would be a charge against us on theft. So we are unable to remove any vessels from here as we would be charged in a manner of theft. Because of this, the business has been shut down for nearly two years. It's very frustrating. For local governments, FWC is now allowing them to get paid for removing unclaimed boats. I told Savannah that FWC listed 700 derelict vessels on its database. She wasn't shocked. No, I don't feel that number's too high. If you drive anywhere up and down Fort Myers, you'll see vessels just like these ones along the dock sides. She hopes that this new ray of light will get this place back in business. It's going to be a tremendous help on getting that grant and helping us get these vessels out of here. Um, nobody likes to look at this. We certainly don't like to look at this. We would like to get this place back up and running, not only for ourselves, but for our community. Now, if you ever see any boats that might be in danger or abandoned, Report that to FWC. For now, reporting local here in North Fort Myers, Muhammad Abdul Kawi, NBC2.